Hey guys and welcome to a, another episode of um, Past and Present. Um, as you know by the title, the thumbnail and what you can currently see on your screen, we've gone for Southampton as the team for today's episode. Um, as you can see on your screen, we've gone for Stecklenburg who used to play for them in goal, uh, Klein and Alderwald who used to play for them in right back and centre back, Van Dijk and Bertrand in centre back and left back. And then in midfield, we've gone for Lalana and Wanyama who used to play for them. We've gone for Redmond. At centre mid, he's a right mid, but I, like, literally I couldn't think of any centre mids, and I don't know why. Or unless there was there was ones that I didn't want to use. And then up front, we've gone for uh, Walcott and Mane. Obviously moved to Liverpool, a very good player. And then we've gone for Gabby Dini up top, who is going to be our main man striker up there. On the bench, we have got Shane Long, Fraser Foster, Schneiderlin, um, Charlie Austin, Tadic, Chamberlain, and Lauren. As you can see, there's a fair few Liverpool players. You've obviously got Mane, Lalana, Klein, Lovren up there. They've obviously moved to Liverpool. They're known for it. But this is going to be the team that we take into the first uh, game. So let's get into it. Right, guys. So this is the first team that we get matched up against. Uh, an all-BPL team with a very good strike force, very good defence, and a very good midfield. Oscar's the only questionable one, I'd say. But it is what it is. We come up 10 minutes into this game. Do a nice little LT hold off the man. Shield him. Spin him, play it through to Walcott. He just finesses that into the um, the bottom right corner. Uh, one thing on this game which I've never actually said, and it's obviously I know it's pace whoreish, but like from this, from my favourite player personally, not my favourite player, but one of my favourite players who to always buy at the start of the game, always I always get if I do a Rose Glory is uh, the man Walcott himself. He just like he doesn't, he's not got the greatest card other than pace, but he just finishes off everything here. Like as you can see there, we make it. 2-0 um, with a nice little shot into the near post, a nice little uh, through ball from Gabby Dini led to that move. Was debating on just like um, lacing it to the bottom left corner, but we decided to go near post, end up slotting it in with Walcott, which is always nice. A very good finish. Uh, we come up 3-0 just after the start of the um, second half, so basically you can kick off. Nice little LT shield again, just the guy, he couldn't do anything about it, he just ran past. It's very overpowered, but... Uh, again, like I said in the previous episode, we we shushing him because he just he's playing like a bit of a, a bit of an idiot now. I kind of wanted him to leave because no one likes playing against people like that. But that makes it three 0 with Mane there. Wanyama picks up a nice little pass into Gabby Dini. Again, we go near post with his left foot. Obviously, his strong foot. Bit of a bit of a dickhead celebration again, but it's what it is. I don't really care. But that's 4 0 in the 52nd minute. Can't complain. Nice little pass in there. Nice little pass to Gabby Dini. In the near post, finish, tucks it in. Uh, that was that was it for that game. 4 0. One, uh, one goal for Gabby Dini, two for Walcott, and one for Mane. So all three of the attackers scored. They go 4 0, as you see there. This is the second team they come against. A very good team with two random League One players and then the one random bronze centre mid. Don't really understand it, but Ben Arthur and Lacazette are very good players. Uh, Lacazette, his uh, play, uh, SBC card that I have and you still use, is one of my favourite players to play with. Obviously, his team is amazing. I had it, but then I sold it. I just I didn't like that. It was very expensive. But um, we come up 1-0 there with Vanyama at the start of this game. As you can see, well, not the start, 20 minutes in. But nice little, nice little pass through to him there. We started it through with Mane, I believe that is. Does well to evade the first tackle on the second and then slots that in with the finesse shot. Uh, we subbed on Shane Long here, or we brought him on. I think we might have started the game with him. I can't remember. But we played we played Shane Long there. He's got actually a decent card. We run into the uh, his run past his centre backs, calls his goalkeeper about and we kinda we powered it a bit too much, but smashed it into the roof of the net. So you can't complain, they go run through on goal. Then we just smash it into the uh, the roof of the net. Good finish to be fair to him. Uh Walcott sees a nice little pass to Shane Long again. This is it on his right foot. I have no idea what his strong foot is, but I'm assuming it's right, and most players are nowadays. Uh, makes it 3-0 just before um, half time, but that is, for some reason, that is it for this guy. He does end up pausing, as you can see here. He pauses it before he even gets to half time. Leaves, can't complain. 3 0 win. Why would you complain? Shane Long with two goals, one for one Yama, an assist for Walcott, Mane, and Redmond. But um, there you go, guys. That was the team that we used. That's the team that we used for today's episode. Uh, pretty good team, to be fair. Very good, very good defense. Obviously, as you can see there, it's a pretty good defense. The attack's very good. Walcott's very good. Mane is good, in my opinion, as well. But that's just gonna be it for today's episode, guys. If you did enjoy, hit the like button. If you're new around here, why not subscribe? Peace.